Yes, there is plenty of time to still get out and soak in not only some sun, but some warmer temperatures. And it was so warm today, we have a new record. That means, yes, new ink in the record books. Back in 1985, on this date, the record was set at 86 degrees. At Toledo Express Airport, we recorded 87 degrees this afternoon, around 3, 4, even 5 o'clock. So that means that we do have a new number in the book and just another number that will be changed scene and as far as tomorrow I think we'll fall short as far as the records but currently we're still holding on to the 80s it's almost like a summer afternoon outside temperatures are at 86 degrees in Toledo not much of a cool down we have 85 in Napoleon 82 in Adrian upper Sandusky and 80 degrees in Sandusky so many of us Holding on to the 80s, a little bit of a lake breeze though. You can see cooling out temperatures in Monroe at 64 degrees. Now our temperatures to come, though we cool out from the 80s tonight, we're going to be finding those temperatures into the mid 60s for overnight lows. And we're right back into the red though by Sunday evening. Temperatures going to be, I think, even a little bit warmer, not only just 80 degrees, but towards the mid 80s by Sunday afternoon. Now we do have the Glass City Marathon tomorrow. Temperatures by the start of the race is going to be very warm. They'll be around 64 degrees and we will have southwest winds pumping in more warm air. So that's going to help those temperatures to warm up as early as 11 a.m. We'll already be into the 70s, but we do have dry weather in for the race. So for the runners or even those who are going to cheer on the runners should be a nice day to go for a run. Now, as far as the rain, I did have to add a little bit of rain into the forecast, but it won't be here for tonight. It's pretty quiet here on the hour by hour forecast and the same start for some Sunday morning, southwest winds still in place, partly cloudy skies. Things, however, change later into Sunday. You can already see some of that green trying to sneak in. A few isolated showers into the afternoon, and then as we get into the evening, an overnight rain chances build in around midnight and Monday morning. We'll still be looking at some scattered showers as a cold front's going to be sweeping in and making those temperatures, well, not as warm as what they have been. And lows overnight, though, going to be mild around 64 degrees while partly cloudy skies. And for your Sunday, we will have the showers later in the day, and that's still the partly cloudy skies going to allow those temperatures to be into the mid 80s tomorrow. Now, here's that cool down, though. We have 60s on Monday, 50s as we get through the week and into uh, next weekend. We're still seeing those 60s, but Monday we have rain and still yet after a warm weekend, we have frost in the forecast for Wednesday and Thursday morning. Next weekend, though, it looks like late. We'll be tracking some rain to be back into the forecast.